Okay, guys, I'm going to be reading the Speedy Mask book. Hopefully, not too much strange. Meet Cowboy Gecko and Owlet. Together, these friends are the Raiden PJ Masks. Each member of the team has incredible superpowers, but its teamwork makes them unstoppable. This trio has the strength of friendship to guide them on their extraordinary adventures. PJ Masks, Girl on the Way. Into a night to save the day. Here it's all wet. Cowboy and Gecko. I don't know who these characters are. I, I don't know. Uh, Cowboy is a main tweet fast and incredible. I, I agile. His hearing is extraordinary. He can hear the smallest sounds from really far away. Romeo, when Romeo, I think that's his name, when Romeo and his robot can creep in the room, Catboy is there to make sure his mysterious inventions, quote unquote, never seen a light of day. That is quite disturbing in a kid's book. Talking about death in a kid's book. No, I'm not really going to say what Jeff is. Uh, <laughs> Super Cat Stripes. Luna Girl looks a lot like a moon king. Hawk Moth. Cat Noir. And uh, just a tiny bit of uh, Norman Osborn. Has been going. Okay. <clears throat> Luna Girl wants all the daytime fun for herself, even if she has to use Luna Magnet to steal it. Owl Red is the flying hero of the team. She has strong wings and amazing eyesight. One with one powerful flap, her wing wing. Can blow the patties away. Super owl feathers. I'm not gonna say it. Uh, but you know, I'm just not gonna say it. Do you tell much storage it has? Uh, the youngest member of the team is also super strong. With his sticky ability to climb absolutely anything, and his quick change camouflage, he's always ready to defeat the baddies. Night Ninjas. Night Ninja always wants to be the best at everything, but he and his ninjalinos are no match for the Mighty Gecko. Super Wizard Grip. And that's what he says. I actually don't know. I've only seen a few episodes. Only one episode clip. I think it's a cute show. Uh, I don't know how to spell this name. It's the protector of a mystery mountain. She is used to spending lots of time by herself. In fact, her life has seemed so solitary. She has... She has never even heard of a party. When she first meets Owl that Gecko and Catboy, she's a bit shy, but they soon teach her the value of teamwork. So that's them. Um, that's very really cool. I think this is inspired by an episode, but I don't actually know. Well, the baddies are making selfish plans to ruin everyone's fun. It's up to the PJ Mask to do the right thing and make the right choices. Sometimes being a hero means more than having superpowers. It's about learning from your friends and working together. PJ Masks all show hooray because in, in the night we saved the day. So, yeah, here's all the figurines. Uh, there is... 
like not very good paint quality to be sneaker games. So that's a disappointment. Uh I do have the white white ear one. And the uh, Ice Age one now. So yeah, that one. Uh I won't be able to get this on camera, but uh got Catboy I think Catboy. I will wear it. Gecko. Uh, I forgot that character's name. Luna Girl, I think. I think that is a bad guy. He, he I don't know how to spell her name, but she's a hero, I guess. I don't know. Wait, can I pay flips? I'm the best. I just love figurines. However, not exactly everything comes in good paint quality. Where could the Tovia figurines? Trash. Not that they're trash, they're just not good paint quality and you can't get it at the correct size. I mean, these are okay figurines. However, I don't know what the robot's name is. But it seems like this part, this guy here is a good guy. The robot. These two, these. These four characters are bad guys. Yeah, so that is PJS my big works. Uh here are the figures of the back of the log. Four dollars and fifty cents. Yeah. Uh I really don't know who the robot character is. It didn't explain anything about that robot. Um yeah, you know, you got two ninjas. I don't even know their names. I will let whatever his name is. Luna Girl, Gecko, whoever he is, and Cowboy. So, yeah. If you know the characters of a PJ Masks, let me, let me know. Please let me know what the robot name is. I, I seriously don't know. I All I know is that they work in the night for most of it. It seems to me like they're mass vigilantes, superheroes. But in Rusty Rivets, I believe, I believe that this actor who plays as whoever this character is could be the exact same voice actor as the villain in the episode. If it's still like a Rusty Rivets, but I have not seen that show in a long time. I seriously don't remember. Uh, yeah, this is licensed by Hasbro. E1 and Frog Buck. And I have tried. Trust me, guys. They will not enter. They will not enter right here. If you try it, I even tried emailing it as a request to do a fall saving the Wild House, but they just will not answer. Some points me they don't work. Yeah. I mean, I tried. I tried my best. Hopefully they might do my request one day. And maybe I might see a boss baby. And what else eventually in the Cascarone days. God rest in peace of Cascarone days. Yeah. In honor of a lot of baby. I want to get it. God rest me. Uh, they have done... Paw Patrol, that's a Nickelodeon show. It's on Shimmer and Shine, which is also a Nickelodeon show. I'm hoping they can do a Wild House, which is also a Nickelodeon show. But not only that, Boss Baby, which is a DreamWorks movie. They've done How to Train a Dragon, which is DreamWorks. 
Why can't they make pasta in the White House? Why? Why the company? Why? I tried you nine. It won't work. Okay, anyways. Uh, I believe that the show is on Disney Plus. Because Disney Store has made. Well, I clearly remember watching a video. And it was. It did say Disney Store. So I think it was so quickly on Disney Plus. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah. So, yeah, that is Little Figurines. However, I don't know his robot name, unfortunately. Yeah, so that is PG Masks, My Bitch Lips.